Hey guys, Nikki here and I have my birthday haul. Before we get started, if you did not catch my birthday vlog, I will leave it right here. It will scroll across the screen and I will leave it below for you guys. I'm not going to do a long drawn out intro because you guys know it's going to be a lot of stuff. So let's get to it. Before I get started, this will be heavy on the fragrance, just like all of my spoiler myself videos. That's just what I'm into right now. So I will try to time stamp it, like if you're not into fragrances or something, but child, you need to watch this video. Um, yeah, so like I said, let's just get to it. Okay, so most of this stuff is gifts, but if I have a link, you know, I will link it below. So I'm just gonna grab, okay? So from Shook, I got the Cotton Candy Shea Scrub. I got the Cotton Candy Tree Hut Shea Sugar Scrub. I have been dying to try this scrub. You guys talk highly of it. It actually was a two-pack, but Suge has one. So I got that. <laughs> so guys, that came from Amazon. Along with these glasses right here, I saw my good sis Gina. The mind they plant, y'all know how much <laughs> orchid dust they plant every day is gonna get right back dusty. She wear these, not these, in her videos all the time. So I got them in pink. They're like the Prada dupes. Here's the color that she wear all the time. They're like beige. Super cute. And you can get a listing where you get all of them in one or two colors. So I got this one and it came with black and the pink ones I bought separately. So here's the black pair. I love these kind of glasses. They almost cover up everything. You just put them on with some gloss and go. All right, so I will link these below. Before I go any further, everything that I have on, including this cute little top from Shein, will be linked below except this necklace because my jeweler made it custom. Um, I'll link him below too. Uh, my Apple Watch band, my bangles, my hair, below. Click below. <laughs> so guys, here's another gift from Suge, which is gonna seem very odd because of how I'ma show it, but it has a picture of me, her, and my son on it. And you put it on the stand and it light up and turn. But uh, yeah, we ain't trying to go there today, so I'm not gonna even open it. We ain't crying today, all right? <laughs> Burlington had these Hermes dupes, the fur ones. So I got them in this pretty like blush nude color. And girl, guess what? Y'all know I live for Burlington. They were $14.99, but got marked down to $10.99, but I put it on Snapchat. That's why it's very important to be following me on my other social media sites because there's no telling when I will have time to do a video. And I'm quite sure these are out of stock now. But if you was on my Snapchat, you would know. <laughs> So you guys have been asking me a lot about my Louis Vuitton Apple Watch band. Um, I told you guys that I went on the website and they say that this stuff is made out of repurposed Louis Vuitton Gucci, but I don't know about all that. And I ain't trying to get my channel took down. So you're going to have to hit me somewhere else to find out where I get these bands. So I did get another one and this is how it came packaged. I just needed a black band. And as you guys can see, this one has the G, G print in it. So yeah, I absolutely love the quality of those bands, so I do plan on collecting more. If you watch my vlogs, at the end of one of my vlogs, my friend had dropped me off tip treats, flowers, and cabbage and cornbread, honey. So uh, this is the bag, because y'all know them cookies, they was open before I even opened them. Yeah, now y'all see why I be keeping stuff in my room. I didn't get to open my own birthday cookies. Let's carry on. <laughs> I got a card from Shannon. I talk about her every video. She always send cards, especially like she was sending like two a week when my son passed away. She was putting cash in them and everything. So this says, for special you, help your birthday is just the beginning of a year filled with good friends, good times, and lots of happiness. And it's purple. And then she did write on the inside, but you guys know I never uh, read those anymore. And it says, I love you or whatever. And there's a Starbucks gift card in here. <laughs> oh, I'm about to be grilled cheese, please. Grilled cheese, please. <laughs> Thank you, Shannon. <laughs> All right, guys, so let's move it to fragrances. So this video will be sponsored by Dossier. Come on now, y'all knew that. Y'all knew that, right? I'm heavy into fragrances. I love Dossier fragrances, so it works out for everybody. So I will leave the link to Dossier below along with my discount code because that's the fam over there, the fam bam. So the reason why I include the Dossier sponsor in this video... 
<laughs> the Dossier sponsorship in this video is because I'm going to buy a lot of fragrances. And I know that YouTube is very, very influential. So I don't want you guys to feel like you have to go out and spend hundreds of dollars on a bottle of perfume like I did. I actually probably have over like 6000 Now that I say that... Okay, maybe $3,000 worth of perfume over here. But you can get the same thing from Dossier. So let me show you a couple of my favorites. So let me show you a couple of my favorites. So right here is Floral Rhubarb. And this one is Ambery Saffron. This is the bottle right here. Dossier bottles start at roughly $29 a bottle. And they go up to like $49, $59 I want to say. They have this cool magnetic top right here. Um, You can buy it before you try it. So if you get it and you don't like it, you can send it back. I put what it is inspired by right here because I have a lot a lot of bottles and I don't want to forget and I just love them look how clean and chic the bottle is so as I was saying I pulled out these two because I have a lot of perfume and this is the two that I am putting a dent in like especially this one y'all know what this one is I'm about to spread it thing on now Marc Jacobs perfect I love the center Marc Jacobs perfect it is just so fresh and fruity and sweet and dossier version is floral rhubarb okay so make sure you put this in your cart because clearly i use it and i have over 100 bottles worth of fragrances so if i use it this much that means it's good okay same as this you guys know i gifted my baccarat to my bestie because at i didn't really see the hype and now i wear this dang on ambery saffron every day and the baccarat dupes every day like I kind of regret giving it away. I always do that though. But anyway, Ambery Saffron, you have to get it, okay? Like I said, they start at $29 a bottle. I love the company. They always have deals. I have a discount code. It's a win-win situation for everybody, okay? So let's move into the fragrances that I bought. So I'm just going to start with the lore and move my way up. Everybody had been hopping on Ebony Woods. One of you guys actually sent me Ebony Woods because it got popular. Kyra made it popular right when my son passed away. So I wasn't even on social media, but they was like, but they were like, I can't let you miss the hype. So they sent it to me. That was so sweet. So I did get the small bottle. This is the bottle that is $19.90, and I will leave the link to it below. This is how my bottle look right here, and I absolutely love this fragrance. When I first tried it on, it was not something that I thought I would love, but oh, it lasts so long. And by the way, okay, this is their collaboration with Joe Malone, okay? I don't have any Joe Malone fragrances to show you this high, but oh, this smells so good to me. It's so different to me. It's really woodsy, ebony woods, but it's still sweet and it's grown. It almost feel like it can be unisex. Is this unisex? I don't know. There is a bigger bottle, but be good luck trying to get it because Kyra has sold that perfume out, okay? So let's move into Banana Republic. If you guys don't remember the last Follow Myself video, I showed you guys Dark Cherry and Amber. I actually managed to get this from Burlington. Y'all know, Burlington, put, put your girl on a commercial, okay? Um, I was looking for it on Amazon. Walked into Burlington. It was $19 in there. Mm, this is bum, but this video is not about this. The point of showing you guys that is because I went into Burlington and looked up and found two more Banana Republic fragrances for $19. And I felt like that one was so good. These had to be good. So if you don't know, this is how the Banana Republic box fragrances come. They have a little pullout tab right here. And the fragrance usually sits right there. So I got two different fragrances. This one right here is Black Platinum. Like, whoa! Even if I don't like this scent, who taking it back or who giving it away is not me. It's trying to focus on my face, y'all. Look at that. Black Platinum. And while I have it focused in, this one is Gardenia and Cardamom. So this is the one I thought I wasn't going to like. And I actually like Gardenia and Cardamom better than Black Platinum. Don't get me wrong. They both smell good. But this is just a little fresher. Sorry. Mm, yeah, I look. Mm, mm -hmm. I didn't think I was going to like it, but I was like, it's only 19 bucks. And if I don't like it, I can put it on my Kyrie. Now, this is more masculine. It's very masculine. It's very like, and I just don't like smelling like no men. Is it for men? Is this all this human sex? But I'm keeping it because of the name. Do you have to run and hunt this one down? Yeah, I would to collect them. <laughs> but. The dark cherry amber one is still my favorite, okay? 
So while we're on that line, I did get some Juicy Couture fragrances. Out of Burlington, this one was $39.99. Okay, and this is the regular Juicy Couture. This is my favorite. I'm not gonna zoom in because it's showing, okay? This put me in the mind of the original Gucci Bloom in the pink bottle. And you guys don't like that. Y'all say it's real old lady-ish, but girl, your girl is 41 now. <laughs> Let me fix my... Your girl is 41 now, so I am old here. I'm, I'm the lit auntie, okay? Yeah, that's gonna be my new tag. Like, Jenny got thick bestie, everybody. Yeah, I'm the lit auntie, okay? Because I'm that auntie that, like, that's old but still act young and do young shit. That's me, okay? Y'all start calling me the lit auntie. So, this was my favorite. I also got Viva La Juicy, and that one was 49. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold up, hold up. I just know. I just know I didn't do that, but I did. And my little chain thing missing. Ain't it supposed to be like a little chain or something dangling off of this? Maybe this is our older bottle. Now, I do like this every day out of the shower. This is more like a big sugar fragrance for me. It's sweet. It would be good mixed with something like this black platinum, but I wouldn't just put it on and wear it alone because I'm a little bit too <laughs> grown for that. All right. So the last Juicy scent I got is called Bye Bye Blue by Juicy Couture. And this one was only $19.99. And this bottle alone, look at the bottle with the little crown at the top. And this is kind of like, just like Viva La Juicy. It's different, but it's it's a little bath and body work sprayish to me. Which there is absolutely nothing wrong with that. Don't cancel me, y'all. Don't, don't cancel me. Because I love bath and body work. But what I, if I want a body spray, I get a body spray. When I want a perfume, I want a fragrance. You get what I'm saying? So this is more like getting out the shower going to bed type also all right so we're gonna keep it moving on up and let's move into some designer fragrance so guys this will be my lower end designer for not lower end designer houses okay so I, my friend Teresa bought me this little rollerball and you guys know that she took it my one of my other vlogs so she sent me the full bottle for my birthday and this is the box right here look at the box itself it's just like I don't keep boxes, but if you do, this is one of those you definitely should keep. And then here's the container right here. Oh, isn't this just the cutest thing ever? It is the only scent that MCM provides right now. And I just love it. It's fr I can't spray on everything I'm talking about, though, y'all. It's just fresh. It's airy. Everyday work. You're not too overwhelming at work where people be like, oh, she coming here with that loud stuff on every day. It's just perfect. You know, church or something like that. So you guys saw this already, so I'm not going to talk too much about it. This is Versace Versace. I accidentally opened this because it was left on my bed and it was my birthday gift. One of my birthday gifts from Nicole. Okay. So yeah, I am the queen of having to. Girl, let me button up. <laughs> Ooh, can they fit in her? <laughs> okay. I am the queen of having to retract what I say. I had to retract it about House of Siage and the cupcakes because I love them now and have got a few more. They're just not here yet. So there will be a birthday haul part two because I got some a fragrance or two that isn't here. Two handbags that isn't here. So I'm going to probably put them in my next spoiler myself instead of doing a birthday haul part two. So Bay bought me this for Christmas about two years ago. <laughs> And I just wasn't feeling it. Well, sis is grown now and my nose has changed. And I love it now. I mean, absolutely love Good Girl by Carolina Herrera. So I, I actually sold it to one of you guys because y'all bought it off my Snapchat and had to go right back in there and get it again because my nose has changed drastically. Like, I couldn't even believe it. So I didn't stop there because the salesperson was very good and talked me into getting very good girl. And that's the red shoe. Okay. So let me tell you guys the difference in my opinion. Nighttime, day, night, every day. This is like more springy, floral, fruity, flirty. This is more, I'm trying to get eight all night. All right. So we're going to keep it pushing. And uh, y'all see how I slipped that in. <laughs> I am getting into hair fragrances now because I actually do spray my fragrance in my wigs. Okay, so this is Good Girl, the hair mist. And it came in a little shoe too. It's just a little cute shoe. The only difference with the hair mist is you actually take it off like, hold on y'all, I'm break some. Take it off like this and spray it. With the actual perfume, you spray it directly out the shoe. 
all right so let's move into still designer fragrances but we taking it up a notch uh, 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 uh. okay so what i do know and what i have discovered about miss chanel honey thumbnail is that i absolutely love coco mademoiselle probably can't tell yeah you can tell like I said, I have so many fragrances, it's hard to... Thumbs up if you want me to do a video on, like, the fragrances that I've done it, okay? Um, um, but what I do know is I don't enjoy the number nines, fives. Those are too, too advanced for Big Plat, okay? So we're going to stick with the Cocos and what I'm about to show y'all. Now, there is a new number five that I do like. I think it's called Lue, a Lou, a Lou, something like that. I did get that as well, but it's not here yet. I wasn't going to hold this video up waiting on stuff. Like I said, I'll just show it in my neck, spoiling myself. But what I did get was a whole bunch of other stuff. Like a whole bunch. All right. And there is a card in here. That's all the cards say. <laughs> so let me just show you everything I got and tell you why I got it. So I absolutely love Coco Mademoiselle. If you're ever in doubt, just get Mademoiselle. The bomb. Everybody loves this. You gonna smell like everybody, but you gonna smell good, okay? Um, but they do have a. Hold on, let me make sure I'm pulling out the right stuff. They do have a version that's meant to like wear to bed. So it's in a frost bottle, as you guys can see. So let's put that one up since you guys know the comparison. But this is called Le Preve. I'm, I know I'm jacking it up, but you get what I'm saying. It will all be below. This is more. This is. This is lighter, airier. It isn't. I don't know what's going on today, but it is. It's just. It's you can wear this to bed. It's meant to be. You can wear it to bed. Of course, it's a little cheaper than that one. So if you like a lighter fragrances, get. If you like lighter fragrances, uh 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 uh. If you like a lighter fragrance, get this one. You know, it's not going to last as long as the original Coco Mademoiselle, but you'll have it. Speaking of Coco Mademoiselle, this is how much I like it, y'all. I got the Intense, but I got the smaller bottle of the Intense because if you got a big bottle of the regular and a big bottle of the light, okay, you overdoing it at this point, Nikki. And Intense is exactly what it say. It has the same exact feel to it but it's a little bit stronger nighttime sexier so i picked that up along with that i picked up a small bottle of the coco nor this is the one that come in the black bottle mm, this good too y'all this is good 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 this will this will get you kissed okay <laughs> so that's that one right there and because i love coco mademoiselle so much I got the hair mist so I just told you guys that I'm starting to get the hair mist if you guys bought some of my wigs you will know that they smell like Baccarat gentle fluid because when I spray I do all this but there's alcohol in most fragrances so that's not good for hair so you get the hair mist and it just you know you just spray it in your hair and it won't mess with your hair mm, I love this smell oh my gosh so that's everything that I got from Miss Chanel honey well, fragrances. Seven more <laughs> bottles, y'all. Seven more bottles. I'm only going to show you five right now because two of them are Louis Vuitton. So I'm going to save them from when I unbox the Louis Vuitton stuff because believe it or not, I haven't even opened it. The fragrances I have with the other stuff. So if I open these boxes and they empty or something, what would I do, girl? <laughs> All right. So along, we're going to start with MFK. So you guys know I love Gentle Fluidity, fluidity Go. <laughs> Did it. Oh, I almost put it on. Oh, this is bae. This is bae. But I refuse to buy the bigger bottle. Actually, I don't even think I'm going to buy. I'm just going to go ahead and show you a little sneak peek. This size bottle, when I'm out of this, I'm going to buy the big $500 bottles. That's how much I love this, okay? But I looked up some dupes. Oh, my gosh. That's so dang on grown and sexy. It's really sweet. Oh, I love it. Oh, my gosh. I love it. Anyway, I found the Duke Ocha. I told you guys about it on um, Snapchat. Pretty cute box. Only 39 bucks. Head smack on. The only, only difference. I'm not going to lie. There is a difference. This has a note at the end of it that turns it quite woody to me. But like if I want to just go one of that, 
and 10 of these. <laughs> I'm not wasting my $100 bottle of perfume versus 39. Does that make sense? Great dupe. Great, great, great dupe. Give it a try. Give it a try. I'm just letting you know that there is a little something in there that is a little different from Gentle Fluidity Go. So, since I'm on MFK, because I wasn't going to show that at first, I did get two more scents. So, let's talk about those real quick. I did get um, Grand Soar. Okay. Um, I sampled this in the store. It was like, you're coming home. It's good. It's great for winter, fall. Mm, it's sweet as well. I'm trying not to spray this stuff, y'all. So just know that I got it because I love it. Now, if you guys remember when I got the samples of Gentle Fluidity, I got samples. Okay, when I bought Baccarat, I got samples of gold and silver of Gentle Fluidity. Just in case you didn't know, both of these, this is gold. Of course, this is silver. Um, has the exact same notes in it, but they smell exact, they smell nothing the same. So they I guess they mix more of something, less of this, and it gave you two whole different scents. But this one, gold, I will say is more for a female, and silver is for a male. So why did I pick this up? Here's the box right here. Why did I pick this up? I absolutely will tell you the truth. When they sent the sample straight from the MFK website, I like silver more. But when I spray silver versus gold on my body, silver just turned all the way man on me like all the way and the problem i'm having is i bought it from sax fifth you guys saw that in my blog they were roughly 235 dollars each and dallas don't have a sax fifth i did not know that i was in houston so there is no way unless i go back to houston i can exchange this bottle um so i'm gonna try to see if i can do it online and when i do it online i'm not sure what i'm gonna get because i actually did get satin oud but honestly i'm gonna choke myself i cannot find it i cannot it's right here on the receipt so i'm guessing it's probably rolled in babe car somewhere or something so i'll look for it when she gets home but she's not here right now so they gave me samples of satin oud and aqua universalis and they gave me a baccarat candle so if you get the real baccarat candle it's 110 dollars so they gave me this little one for free but sis paid for it somewhere which i get what i'm saying so i thought that was so cute that little teeny tiny it is bitty baby candle okay so let's move it to uh, so let's move into perfumes de marley so we're gonna start with y'all know what i got because everybody on it delina all right my cousin gave me a sample oh that hurt my nails so bad oh i need a break i'm trying to be a g but it hurt get it together woman all right so my cousin gave me a sample of delina a long time ago and i used that sample like when me and Bay was doing all our staycations used that sample everywhere i went i mean to the warehouse district out to eat everybody was complimenting me on my fragrance my cousin gave me the sample because it was like a, a big sample. I don't know where she got that from. She said, ooh, I almost sprayed it. Sprayed it. She said it turns sour on her. It does have a sour note. It, but it ain't like sour booty or nothing like that. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> it's like sour like... Is that lychee? It's a good sour. It's like sour patch kids, not sour booty. Okay. All right. So, I love it. I love it. Then here she go, coming over here with this. And I was like, I just had to get it. So I actually went to Macari and a lady sells um, the travel, not the travel, the sample bottles. This was still $200 plus. And I got the Delina, oh, it's the tester bottle, not the sample, the tester bottle. And I got Delina Exclusive. This right here, nigga. Oh man, say hold on. Let me tell you something, cause I'm very, I'm very kind of aggravated that they put both of these in the same bottle. So the only reason why you know is they say Delina exclusive right here, exclusive right there. Got the same little Sororski crystal right here and everything. But this one is way more expensive. Not way more. It's more expensive than um the regular one. And but if you have to pick, listen to me good. If you can't afford both, go with exclusive. I'm trying to tell y'all something. It's the exact same thing, but don't have that sourness at the end. And it has this, it dries down to the, oh, I don't want lipstick on my tassels. This fresh baby, oh gosh, this smells 
freaking awesome. All right, all right. Are we done with perfume? Let's move it to Coach. <laughs> so guys, so guys, here go Coach. Hold up. I guess they just feel like being aggravating as hell because here they funky asses go talking about some come on in and get your birthday discount. I wouldn't even think about coach. You know what I'm saying? But I went. <laughs> so let me show you what I got. They be getting you guys. They be getting you. So I'm going to start by, I needed a new umbrella, no joke, no cap. I'm not playing. I just wonder you guys sent me a ladybug one years ago and it tore the last time it rained. So this one was 68, but I think it was only like 28 because you know, coach always got 60, 70, extra 15 ish. And I went doing when they had the extra 15, it was like a peekaboo TikTok sale or something. And I got another 10% off because it was my birthday. Oh, let me check this and see, make sure because y'all yeah, be capping sometime. Well, I wouldn't even know how to tell about this receipt, which I could see. Um, so what I went in there, I was like, I'm just gonna go in there and get these and be done. See, I already showed y'all the umbrella. This was my goal. I showed these to you guys, um, when I got back from Vegas. They look like Cartier bracelets, but they have co uh, double C's in them. They actually have one that just say coach in them, but it's a little thinner than these. So I don't go for those. Well, these are the rose. This is the rose gold version. You guys know, since I got a, um, well, since I got the rose gold wedding ring, I've been buying a lot of necklaces and rose gold stuff to match. So I have been saying I want the gold and silver ones because I love those braces. They're heavy. They're, they aren't cheapy feeling or anything like that. But I did need three because when I stacked them with my Apple Watch band and stuff, two is enough. So I got two in silver. And these were originally $88. I wouldn't have never paid $88 per bracelet for these. So I did go back and get silver and gold. And if you want a comparison, the silver gold and rose gold. I just got two though. Okay. Then I saw these and was like, they're on sale. Let me get them. So these were originally $98 and they're just hoops. They are hoops and they have coach in them with a little bit of bling. And these are the gold pair. I was going to get gold and silver, but child, I didn't have silver. Okay. So that's everything I got from coach. Okay. Let's go bougie on you guys. If you guys are new to my channel, this just simply mean that they are balling on a budget items. Um, I cannot link them here because YouTube or any other social media um, website does not allow that but get at me somewhere else and we might can work some out okay so most of all of these are Chanel items um, because that's the only brand I just can't do it yet <laughs> I can and let me tell y'all what well, I can financially but it just doesn't make any sense because the only time I wear these bags is when I'm going out to dinner or something trying to look cute in an outfit not every day so, yeah, I already know that if you watch me, if you don't, that's that. So, let's just start with the purple fantasy bag. I got this one. Look. Oh, my gosh. Y'all know I wasn't going to turn this one down. Oh, gosh. Look at the size of this. Purple. That is going to look so cute. I'm going to go really quick, quick on these because I got a lot of more stuff to show you guys in my beauty room. Along with this one. This is more plush. This one feels so good. Oh my gosh, it feels amazing. And I'll just show you guys how the inside look. Oh. Oh, it's earrings in here. And they're cute too. So then I needed a large one in black. So I got this one. It's the exact same size as that purple one. Exact same bag. This ain't your thing. Who cares? <laughs> it's my thing. It's a lot of us thing. You know, I always tell y'all. I spend my money how I want it. Okay. If you saw my birthday vlog, saw my birthday pictures, the night I went to the concert, I had on the rainbow Chanel. And a lot of people who buy like Chanel Chanel hate this collection because they say it, lo it looks cheap and it brings down the value of it. But I saw Alonzo Arnold in this bag and I had to get it. This is it right here. This is from the same collection that the um, one I had on my birthday was in. 
so it does have a, another strap that comes with it like that so if you guys watch oh i don't that video isn't up i went by my bestie um boutique and um yeah that one is not up she gave me this one for my birthday for the fall all right all right and then then her daughter sells bracelets Reese Closet. I talk about her all the time. I talk about, I tell you guys, I got two of my nieces who I buy from and they both make these bracelets. And this is Reese Closet. I do not have a melanin set. And if you guys can't tell, this is like a beautiful chocolate and rose gold set. So I just went ahead and grabbed it up like beautiful brown set. And even though it's brown, it kind of like go perfectly with this first right. It's weird, but it's not any cranberry in here at all. Maybe mm -mm, this is more brown, but it will go with this purse. So I got one more bag. I got a, a speedy bandolier from one of my plugs because if you guys didn't know, you can barely get speedies now. And I sold my vintage speedy, my authentic vintage speedy because I wanted a new one and I can't get a new one now. Well, I couldn't. So I'm just going to show you guys this, which I'm not going to keep. I'm going to sell it because this is the Bandolier 30. I, I'm not going to keep it because when I went into the Louis Vuitton store for my birthday, they told me that I could pay for it then and it'll get to me eventually, but they can't tell me when. They said it could be next week. It could be two months from now. It could be three months from now, but I will eventually get it. So I don't have that bag to show at all because I don't have it yet, but that's why I'm going to, but that's why I'm going to sell this one is because I did go ahead and get the one from the Louis Vuitton store. So let's just move into the high-end stuff <laughs> okay you guys know i am extremely obsessed with kurt geiger lately the bur the purse i had on on my anniversary that's not up but the pictures on instagram that purse was a kurt geiger purse i showed him probably about two spot them yeah i always cheat I showed y'all in about two spoiling myself ago. Um, so this came from Kurt Geiger as well. <laughs> and you can find them in Dillard's, Macy's, Nordstrom's. Their bags are no more than three, four hundred dollars. So if you want to go the affordable route, Kurt Geiger. I just had to have this one. Oh, I love this bag. I love the way it feels. You know, he's known for his signature eagle head. It's spacious. I could put my vlog camera in here. I could put my phone, my keys, my wallet, everything in here. Um, and I absolutely love this purse. I want to say it was $174 because I want to say it was on sale. So if... Um, If this one is a little bit too big for your liking, they do have one that is a medium or a small. This is it on my frame. Y'all see that? <laughs> okay. So, yeah. Oh, gosh. I just love this designer. I love them, love them, love them. And they're very affordable. And they're so different. Okay. So if I had to, I would put this on a category with Coach, Tory Burch, um, you know, that line. It's not too high end, but it is still designer. And I love this bag. So I'm finally down to what you guys want to see. I actually got a chance to go and shop the Louis Vuitton store by myself. Nobody else could come in. Um, and yeah, I did. So, um, disclaimer, I already told you one of the purses not in here because, uh, and then I ordered another bag that isn't in here. Also, um, it is these monogram MM unprint leather turtle dove. It kind of looked beige or cream. I'll insert a picture cause I don't have it, but they, 
they sell it as lavender it's purple is weird um they didn't have that one in store either that's the one i really really wanted i was really hesitant on getting that bag because of the simple fact that i throw my never fools around any kind of way and my never fools have to have to be authentic because i carry them every day and i just know i'm gonna get that bag dirty but I'm going to just have to be a little bit more careful with it, okay? So, this is the bag I got from Louis Vuitton. So, let's go. Y'all ready? Here's one of my perfumes. It came in a bag like this. It was tied. Um, let me just show you guys how the bottle looks. One of these bottles is going back, and I'll explain that when I get to it. Maybe this is the one. Maybe not. I don't, I'm not sure yet. Girl... No, this is definitely not. So this is what the box looked like. That's what the box looked like. So mine were already open because I did get them stamped. And in my vlog, I said if anybody could guess what I got stamped, I will buy you a free bottle. Nobody guessed. Y'all was all the way wrong. Heads up in case you've never shopped in Louis Vuitton or purchased from Louis Vuitton. When you get something stamped, the max you can get is three letters. <laughs> so you guys were saying my son and all the day. And I'm like, it's only three letters. <laughs> Here's the, the box right here. And your perfume usually would sit right here. People keep these, but I don't. <laughs> And guys, it's a story behind this, but I'm going to make it short. This is a Trappy Reves. Woo! This smells so freaking good. Listen to me and listen to me good. Louis Vuitton is high. Well, now that I compare it to like Delina and MFK, it's about around the same price, huh? So what you don't want to do is get home and regret this. Get samples, let it wear on your body. Because I actually picked another fragrance before I picked this one. And my essay said, did you smell this one? After I had already checked out. And she brought this to me. And I was like, ring me up again. I wouldn't have even had this if she wouldn't have said that. But I absolutely love this fragrance. So here's the fragrance right here. And as you guys can see, I got BAP stamped on there in gold which stands for badass platinum period ain't never letting go of that y'all don't say i don't care how much money i got i don't care y'all still be calling me ghetto and stuff anyway and i'ma live that down because baby 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 look what that being ghetto got me <laughs> a lot of y'all quit <laughs> a lot of y'all don't do youtube no more a lot of y'all just <sighs> look what i'm or look where i'm at now okay so anyway um excellent 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 fragrance the top has the lb in it and just in case you didn't know when you use these do not throw the bottle away you can take them back in louis vuitton will refill them for 100 plus 125 145 something like that and heads up right now because of the pandemic and germs if you take your empty bottle back they won't refill it they'll sell you a new bottle for the price of a refill Check your store. Don't quote me on that. But my store do. Okay. So that's the fragrance I would highly recommend from them. So this is the first fragrance. Of course. I, I like it because it's purple. Okay. I, I might make it work and mix it with a little shum shum. But this one is Erdiapsis. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Okay. And this is why I was so mad this didn't work out for me. Because I got this one stamped OCT which says for Oak Cliff, Texas, or October, my birth month. And it's purple. Smelled good at that store. Baby, I got home, this store smelled like bug spray on me. Mm-mm, mm-mm, nope. I'm gonna give it one more world. I'm gonna give it one more world. But I just love that it's purple. But if I take this back, which my essay said I couldn't, usually you can't. But they depend on your history and all that. My, my store manager told me I could. I'm going to get the rose one. I absolutely love that scent. And how I know that is because they gave me this bag right here. And it is full of samples. So there are my two bottles. OCT, BAP. <laughs> all y'all was wrong. <laughs> so, yeah. Things look and sound a little different. Because my memory card on the big camera was full. 
and sis gotta go out tonight i, I wasn't finna go through all that so i'm on a whole different camera whole different view but we're gonna keep it pushing they sent they sent girl i'm so used to revealing stuff and then louis vuitton didn't send you this here's my next purchase came in a they call this the pull tab drawer or something like that all right so came in the bag this is it right here and it clamps you just slide it in like that and yeah has the little LV right here and right here and I will tell you the price of all of this stuff so I do have two separate receipts because like I said I smelled that perfume last and so she rung it up at a later Okay, yeah, so that perfume was, the perfume was $265 each. The bracelet, wow, that heart. BB band, wow, that heart. What the heck is that? Oh, that bracelet was, the bracelet was $265 as well. Everything on here almost $265. The bandolier was $1,800 roughly. Oh, I don't want to mess up the bow, but this is another something else I got. See, this is always my fear. Like, why would this happen and why do I think like this? But I'm like, let you get home and ain't put your shit in here. Okay, so yeah, I know how I feel about my bando. So I got another bando. And this is the Wild at Heart bando. You guys know you can put these around your hair, your purse, or a mezzo scarf. And it just has the pink. Um cheetah print is that cheetah and this side looks like this and so they and so these are the runaway sneakers they came in this box and so i was gonna get some slides and the lady was looking in the system and was like you have enough slides and da, da, da. she was like get some sneakers and y'all know i'm not a sneaker girl but here lately i have been and i'm trying to get into it but i don't really even go anywhere like that i'm not gonna be no sneaker head like sugar so how you open it? Pull it like that. What's this in here, y'all? Shoe strings. And I'll just show you guys one shoe. They do each come with their own dust bag. So when you travel, you don't get them damaged. And this is the shoe. Oh, I love these tennis shoes. Love them, love them, love them. So I done kept y'all long enough so long that I ran out of memory cord and had to come to another camera. So I love you guys. Thank you for watching. I will link as much as I can below. And I'll see y'all in my next video. Don't forget to check out Dossier. All right. Bye.